আমাদের চারজন ফাইনালিস্টকে খুঁজছি আরও দুজনকে আমাদের সেমিফাইনালের টপ সেকেন্ড অ্যান্ড থার্ড স্কোরার্সকে নিয়ে আমরা শুরু করতে যাচ্ছি দুটি প্লে অফ রাউন্ড আজকে প্রথম প্লে অফ আমাদের সাথে আছে আমাদের চারজন চমৎকার স্পেলার্স তাদের সাথে মিট করব তার আগে আপনাদেরকে সাদর আমন্ত্রণ জানাচ্ছি আমাদের এই আয়োজনে ইউ আর ওয়াচিং দ্য থার্ড সিজন অফ দ্য ডেইলি স্টার স্পেলিং বি পাওয়ার্ড বাই হরলিক্স ব্রট ইউ বাই চ্যাম্পস টোয়েন্টি ওয়ান ডট কম ইন অ্যাসোসিয়েশন উইদ বিএসআর এম মেট লাইফ অ্যালিকো অ্যান্ড ফাবার কাস্টার্স আমি রোমানা মালিক মুনমুন অ্যালং উইথ আর অফিশিয়াল প্রোনাউন্সার মিস ইজ নাদ্র বানি উইল টেক ইউ থ্রু দিস জার্নি আমরা চমৎকার চমৎকার সব স্পেলার্সদেরকে পেয়েছি আমাদের এই সিজনে আর এক একজন তাদের পারফরমেন্সে মুগ্ধ করে চলেছে আমাদের সবাইকে আমি জানি আপনারা আমাদের সাথে আছেন এই পুরো জার্নি জুড়ে আপনারা দেখেছেন আমাদের এই পর্যন্ত যতগুলো স্পেলার্সকে আপনাদের সামনে আমরা প্রেজেন্ট করেছি ইচ ওয়ান অফ দ্যাম আর ওয়ান্ডারফুল মাইন্ড ব্লোয়িং ফ্যান্টাস্টিক তাদের পারফরমেন্স দেখে আমরা সবাই মুগ্ধ হয়েছি প্রতিনিয়ত এবং আমরা বিশ্বাস করি এই চমৎকার স্পেলার্সদের উপরে নির্ভর করছে আমাদের বাংলাদেশের ভবিষ্যৎ সো উই উড লাইক টু থ্যাংক দ্যাম উই উড অলসো লাইক টু থ্যাংক ইউ ফর ইউর কনস্ট্যান্ট সাপোর্ট যার কারণে আজকে আমরা আমাদের সিজন থ্রি নিয়ে আপনাদের সামনে হাজির হতে পেরেছি আমরা খুঁজছি আমাদের সিজন থ্রি এর চ্যাম্পিয়ন স্পেলারকে আর চ্যাম্পিয়ন স্পেলারের জন্য অপেক্ষা করছে এই গর্জেস ট্রফিটি পাশাপাশি ওয়াশিংটন ডিসিতে একজন অভিভাবক সহ ভ্রমণের সুযোগ ও পাঁচ লক্ষ টাকার ম্যাথ লাইফ আলিকো শিক্ষা বিমা আমাদের ফার্স্ট এবং সেকেন্ড রানার আপের জন্য রয়েছে তিন লক্ষ এবং দু লক্ষ টাকার ম্যাথ লাইফ আলিকো শিক্ষা বিমা আমরা অপেক্ষা করতে পারছি না কারণ যে চারজন স্পেলার্সকে নিয়ে আমরা কম্পিটিশন শুরু করতে যাচ্ছি তাদের জন্য এটা দ্বিতীয় সুযোগ গ্র্যান্ড ফিনালেতে নিজেদের জায়গা সিকিওর করার সো লেটস গেট ইন্ট্রোডিউস টু দ্যাম অ্যাট ফার্স্ট উই হ্যাভ চৌধুরী নবিলা তসলিম স্টুডেন্ট অফ ইউরোপিয়ান স্ট্যান্ডার্ড স্কুল ওয়েলকাম ওয়ান সেকেন্ড নবিলা যদি তোমাকে প্রশ্ন করি হাউ কনফিডেন্ট আর ইউ টু মেক ইট থ্রু টু দ্য ফিনালে গ্রেড ইট আউট অফ ফাইভ ফাইভ আউট অফ ফাইভ দ্যাট সাউন্ডস ভেরি কনফিডেন্ট ওয়েলকাম Moving on, we have student from Marie Curie School, Wasik Hassan. Welcome once again, Wasik. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. How much will you give yourself? Four out of five. Where is that rest of the one? We'll see after I'm finished. Okay, that sounds good. Welcome. <laughs> Moving on, we have Ryan Farhab, student of Scholastica. How are you, Ryan? Fine, Alhamdulillah. Very good. What about you? Um, I'd go with a five, yeah. <laughs> good luck. Finally we have a very lively very much friendly and always with a big smile Prokka Paramita student of Sunbeams how are you doing I'm good and how much will you give yourself 4.5 Okay um I hope the 0.5 will be added after the yeah. end of the competition all right welcome all of you once again and now let's begin the competition with our first round which is spell it Spell it, you know, you'll be asked four words to spell. Within 20 seconds, you'll have to start the spelling. You'll be giving you the definition. You can ask for Bangla meaning and parts of speech. 40 points, which can be earned very easily if you keep yourself calm. Viewers, you can hear your first round. 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 Let's go to our first contestant, Nabila. All the very best. Nabila, the first word for you is obscenity. Obscenity, and it means the state or quality of being obscene. The word is obscenity. O-B-S-C-E-N-E-T-Y, obscenity. Nabila, you almost had it, but that isn't correct. The correct spelling is O-B-S-C-E-N-I-T-Y, obscenity. That's okay, three more words left. All the best, Nabila. The second word for you is smorgasbord. Smorgasbord, and it means a range of open sandwiches and savory delicacies served as buffet. The word is smorgasbord. S-M-O-R-G-A-S-B-O-R-D, smorgasbord. That is correct. Beautiful, 10 points. The third word for you is falchon. Falchon, and it means a broad, slightly curved sword with the cutting edge on the convex side. The word is falchon. Falchon. Falchon is the word. F-A-U-L-C-H-O-N, falchion. I'm sorry, Nabila, that isn't correct. The correct spelling is F-A-L-C-H-I-O-N, falchion. Don't let that bother you. Last word for you. The final word for you is peak. Peak, and it means a feeling of irritation or resentment resulting from a slight, especially to one's pride. The word is peak. P-I-Q-U-E, peak. That is correct. Very confidently spelled. 20 points from this round, Nabila. Well done. Moving on to Wasik. Shall we start? 
Yes. All the best. Walsic, the first word for you is tapestry. Tapestry, and it means a piece of thick textile fabric with pictures or designs. The word is tapestry. Tapestry. T A P E S T R Y. Tapestry. That is correct. Very carefully spelled. So. 10 points. The second word for you is phlegmatic. Phlegmatic, and it means unemotional and calm. The word is phlegmatic. Phlegmatic. Phlegmatic is the word. P H L E G M A T I C. Phlegmatic. That is also correct. Two on two. Very good. The third word for you is tardescent. Tardescent, and it means becoming or seeming swollen. The word is tardescent. Is it tardescent? That could be one way of pronouncing it, but the ideal one should be tardescent. Tardescent. T A R T E S C E N T. Tardescent. Sorry, was it that is incorrect? The word was tardescent, and it's spelled as T U R G E S C E N T. Tardescent. Make sure you have the word correctly. All the best for the last one. The last word for you is De Monte. De Monte, and it means an official denial of a published statement. The word is De Monte. De Monte. De Monte is the word. Is it D I A M A N T E? De Monte? Wasak, you came close, but that isn't correct. The correct spelling is D E M E N T I, De Monte. That's okay. 20 points from this round, Wasak. Viewers, Asha Kuri, you have to do this round. This is the round. This is the round. This is the round. This is the tab. This is the round. This Ryan, all the best, Ryan. Ryan, the first word for you is sequestration. Sequestration. Sequestration is the word, and it means take control of somebody's property or assets until a debt has been paid off. The word is sequestration. Sequestration, okay. S E Q U E S T R A T I O N. Sequestration. That is correct. Thank Good you. Good start, and that was a 13 letter word. Please give him a round of applause. Beautifully spelled. The second word for you is palanquin. Palanquin. Palanquin, and it means a covered litter carried on two horizontal poles by four or six bearers. The word is palanquin. Uh, okay, palanquin. Palanquin, P-A-L-A-N-C-H-E-N-E, -E, palanquin. Ryan, very, very close, but that isn't correct. The correct spelling is P-A-L-A-N-Q-U-I-N, palanquin. Never mind, two more words to go, all the best. The third word for you is ricochet. Ricochet. That could be one way of pronouncing it, but the ideal one should be ricochet. ricochet. And it means rebound off a surface. The word is ricochet. Okay, ricochet. R I C O C H E T, ricochet. That is correct. Beautiful, 10 points. The final word for you is Reich. Reich. And it means the former German state. The word is Reich. Okay, R E I C H, Reich. That is correct. The word brought a smile on Ryan's face. Good job. 30 points from this round. And now moving on to our final contestant, Prugga. All the best. Prugga, the first word for you is regalia. Regalia. Could you please repeat the, the word? The word is regalia and it means the distinctive clothing of high of office worn at formal occasions. The word is regalia. Regalia is the word. Regalia or regalia? Regalia. Start. Start. Um, R E G A L E A. Regalia. Proga, you came very close, but that isn't correct. The correct spelling is R E G A L I A. Regalia. That's okay. Three more words to go, Proga. All the best. The second word for you is onslaught. Onslaught, and it means fierce, destructive attack. O N S L A U G H T onslaught. That is correct. Ten points for you, Pruga. The third word for you is dressage. Dressage. And it means the art of riding and training horses so as to develop obedience, flexibility, and balance. Could the word is dressage. Could you please repeat the word? Dressage. D R E S S A G E dressage. That is correct. 10 more points, good job. The final word for you is 
Ptolemaic. Ptolemaic, and it means relating to the second century Greek astronomer Ptolemy. The word is Ptolemaic. Ptolemaic. That could be one way of pronouncing it. Could you please repeat the word? Ptolemaic. T O L O M A C H E, Ptolemaic. I'm sorry, that isn't correct. The correct spelling is P T O L E M A I C, Ptolemaic. All right, you got 20 points from this round, Prabha. So that brings us to the end of the first round, and we'll be heading for a short holidays break. Before that, after an issue, after their Android phone, I'm on the Spell Champs app to download Korean app to Babhor Kore, Onction and Proti Shukitai, Shukrova, take a Mongol word, Proti Din, Arjitin in Akoshunio tap, Proti Shop Tahe, Horlicks and Shojone. We're going for a short holidays break, but you have to promise that you will stay with us because after the break, we're going to have three more exciting rounds. Stay tuned. <laughs> You're watching the playoff of the third season of the Daily Star Spelling Bee, powered by Horlicks, brought to you by Champs21.com in association with BSRM, MetLife, Alico, and Faber Castell. We completed our first round. Let's take a look at the scores after the first round. Nabila at 20 points. Wasik is also at 20 points. Ryan at 30 points. Proga, 20 points. All right, now get ready for the second round, which is Spell Hive. In Spell Hive, you'll have to crack five words. The first letter of the first word will be given. You can ask for the last letter of the first word. In that case, we'll play the Hive for 45 points instead of 50. Total time, 90 seconds. I believe you all are ready for the second round. Viewers, you know that we have the A-round top scorer in the school library. Do you know that? Around Sheshe, so we'll start with you, Nabila. Once again, all the best. Nabila, the hive is on your screen. And the first word starts with an R. The first word means a red, pink, yellow, or white fragrant flower. The second word means to awaken someone from sleep. The third word means a complaint. The fourth word means a medical practitioner qualified to operate on a patient. And the last word means a very large primitive fish. And your time starts now. Uh, the first word is rose, R O A C rose. That is correct. 10 points. The second word is a rose, A R O S E, a rose. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Move on. Uh, the fourth word is S U R G E O N, surgeon. That is also correct. 10 points. You have a minute, so go through the meanings. The third word means a complaint. Let's try with the letters. Half a minute left. How about the last word, which means a very large primitive fish? Pink. Last 10 seconds, Navila. Any word, any wild guess, maybe? No. And your time is up. Nabila, the second word which you got wrong was rouse, R-O-U-S-E. The third word which you didn't get was grouse, G-R-O-U-S-E. And the last word was sturgeon, S-T-U-R-G-E-O-N, sturgeon. That's good, 20 points. So don't be so disappointed. Two more rounds left. Moving on, Wasik, ready? Yes. All the best. Wasik, the hive is on your screen. And the first word starts with an A. The first word means very dry land or climate. The second word means the machine that sends or receives sound signal. The third word means skillful and clever, especially in dealing with people. The fourth word means two main arteries which carry blood to neck head. And the last word means a ruler who has complete power over a country. And your time starts now. 
Is the first one arid, A-R-I-D? That is correct. Ten points. Is the last word dictator, D-I-C-T-A-T-O-R, dictator? That is also correct. Twenty. Try the second word. Is it radio, R-A-D-I-O? That too is correct. Good going. Is the third left. word adroit, A-D-R-O-I-T? On a roll, that is also correct. Very good, you have plenty of time. Just one word to crack. The fourth word means two main arteries which carry blood to neck head. Meaning is two main arteries which carry blood to neck and head. Is the fourth word carotid? C A R O T I D? That's a wonderfully built hive. Just like a champion, 50 points from this round. Very good, Wasik. Very good. Moving on, Ryan. Wasik has set the benchmark. So it's your turn. All the best. Ryan, the hive is on your screen. And the first word starts with an M. The first word means a female horse or donkey. The second word means a field or domain of activity of or interest. The third word means a person who walks or moves at a slow, relaxed pace. The fourth word means an awkward climb or movement. And the last word means to order a fighter aircraft to take off immediately in an emergency. And your time starts now. Okay, the first word is mare, M-A-R-E. That is correct. 10 points. The second word means a field or domain of activity or interest. Is the third word Romer, R-O-A-M-E-R, Romer? I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Try the second one, you just have to add one letter to it. We need to go. Is the second word Realm, R-E-A-L-M? That is correct. Ten points. Try the fifth one, which means to order a fighter aircraft to take off immediately in an emergency. Half a minute left, don't give up, think. Or the fourth word, which means an awkward climb or movement. Anything coming up in your mind? Is Quickly. the fourth word alarmed? A L A R M E D. Alarmed? I'm sorry, Ryan, that is incorrect. And the time Amber. is also up. <sighs> Ryan, the third word which you got wrong was Ambler. A M B L E R. The fourth word which you got wrong as well was Clamba. C L A M B E R. And the last word which you didn't get was Scramble. S C R A M B L E. Scramble. Ryan, that gives you 20 points. Still have got chance, two more rounds left. Okay, moving on, Proga. Let's start with your one, all the best. Proga, the hive is on your screen. And the first word starts with an M. The first word means an area of deep mud. The second word means a vegetable fiber noted for its length and toughness. The third word means regard with respect or warm approval. The fourth word means to allow somebody to join a group, an organization, or an institution again. The last word means a person who attempts to make people come to an agreement usually in conflict situation and your time starts now. Can I have the clue please? It is an E. The last letter of the first word is an E. Crack the first word if you're confident about any other. Um, uh, give us a word. M-I-D-E, might. 
I'm sorry, that isn't correct. Move on. It's the third word, admire, A-D-M-I-R-E. That is correct. Is the fourth word, readmit, R-E-A-D-M-I-T, readmit. That is also correct. Is the fifth word, mediator, M-E-D-I-A-T-O-R, mediator. That too is correct. Try the second one now. The second word means a vegetable fiber noted for its length and toughness. Ten seconds left. Quickly. Give us a word, quickly. Uh-oh, time's up. Proga, the first word that you got wrong was Maya, M-I-R-E, and the second word which you didn't get was Rami, R-A-M-I-E, Rami. All right, well done. 30 points from this round. And we are at the end of our second round. Let's take a look at your scores after the second round. Nabila at 40 points. Wasek leading the scoreboard with 70 points. Ryan, 50 points. Rob guys also at 50 points. Okay, our other A-rounded top scorer, Hutse Wasek. Wasek, you are our top scorer for this round. And congratulations, you're winning books for Bonobel Ghoria SR Uchubidala, which is situated in Natur. Thank you very much for your great effort. <laughs> and a special thanks to BSRM for this wonderful initiative. Bonobel Ghoria SR Uchubidalai, Natur Jela Abustitu is school tite, Lekapara Kurse, Choi Shujun Shikati. Bortomane is school econo library name. BSRM is a very good thing. The library is a very good thing. The library is a very good thing. The library is a very good thing. The Moving on, we have our third round in line, which is Spell Ring. In Spell Ring, the letters will be on your screen in a ring with a central letter in it. You have to give us a longer one. Longer word consisting of nine letters, which will give you 10 points. You will also have to form four shorter words consisting of four to eight letters, which will earn you 20 points, five for each. Time is 45 seconds, so please be quick and correct. All the best. We'll start with you, Nabila. Nabila, the ring is on your screen, and a central letter is an E. D I V E dive. Please carry on. R I T E right. Continue. D R I V drive. One more. Uh, T I R E tire. Go for the longer one. Uh oh. Forget it. Don't let it bother you. Go for the longer one. Concentrate. Concentrate. Ten seconds. Concentrate on the longer one. You can make it. Just give us a word. And your time is up, Nabila. Nabila, the first word you said was dive, D-I-V-E. The second word you said was write, R-I-T-E. The third word you said was drive, D-R-I-V-E. The fourth word you said was tire, T-I-R-E. All the words have I, but I is missing in the ring. So we cannot take any of those words. You have come up with words such as lead, L-E-A-D, or tell, T-E-L-L, -L, or real, R-E-A-L or late, L-A-T-E. And the full length word which you missed was traveled. T-R-A-V-E-L-L-E-D, traveled. Nabila, sorry, we cannot give any score over here, but it's okay. All right, one more round we have. Okay? Come. Okay, moving on to Wasek. Ready for it? All the best. Wasek, the ring is on your screen. And the central letter is a U. D-U-P-E, dupe. Continue, please. Quickly. Try. Ten seconds left, Wasek. Oh, 
and your time is up. Were you thinking of all those words in your mind or you couldn't come up with any? I... <laughs> Achha, that's okay. You gave us one word. Let's check. Wasik, the only word you said was dupe, D-U-P-E, that is correct. You have also said words such as dual, D-U-E-L, or dual, D-U-A-L, or pulp, P-U-L-P. -P. And the full length word which you missed was applauded, A-P-P-L-A-U-D-E-D, -E applauded. All right, that gives you five points from this round. Well tried. <laughs> Moving on to Ryan. Ready, Ryan? Don't get nervous, please. All the best. Ryan? The ring is on your screen, and the central letter is an E. Uh, where, uh, the first word is sent, S-C-E-N-T. Please the, carry on. Uh, second word is sent, S-E-N-T. Then another word is... Last 10 seconds. You can. Uh, the third word is nest, N E S T. One more, one more, quickly. Then quickly. Go case, C A S E, case. Okay, your time is up. Ryan, the first word you said was sent, S C E N T, that is correct. The second word you said was sent, S C E N T, that is also correct. The third word you said was nest, N E S T, that too is correct. The fourth word you said was case, C A S E, correct as well. And the full length word you missed was intestacy, and it's spelled I-N-T-E-S-T-A-C-Y, intestacy. So that gives you 20 points from this round. Very good, Ryan. Now, Proga, it's your turn. Good luck. Proga, the ring is on your screen, and the central letter is an I. Um, B-I-L-E, bile, R-I-L-E, rile. Please carry on. R I B crib. Keep going. One more shot of word. Ten seconds left. Quickly, give us a word. C O I L coil. Longer one? Oh, okay. Time's up. Proga, the first word you said was bile, B-I-L-E, that is correct. The second word you said was rile, R-I-L-E, that is also correct. The third word you said was crib, C-R-I-B, that too is correct. The fourth word you said was coil, C-O-I-L, correct as well. And the full length word you missed was coursable, and it's spelled as C-O-R-E-C-I-B-L-E, coursable. So that gives you 20 points. Very good, Proga. And this brings us to the end of the third round. The scoreboard looks a little different now, but we'll find out after the short break. Don't go anywhere. Coming back after the short Horlicks break. After the break, you are watching the third season of the Daily Star Spelling Bee Powered by Horlicks, brought to you by Champs21.com in association with BSRM, MetLife, Alico and Faber-Castell. Cholche Playoff. At your charge on, participant akhon aamadhe shathe aache. Tadir etai akta shujok, grand finale te nijay dheer jayega nishchit karar. Aamra shesh kore phe lehetse aamadhe third round. Let's take a look at your scores after the third round. Nabila at 40 points. Wasek leading with 75 points. Ryan at 70 points. Proga at 70 points. Now, get ready for your final round, which is Spell Buzz. In Spell Buzz, we'll give you two clues. The first clue will have the meaning of the word along with the number of letters present in the word and the first letter of the word. The second clue will have the letters in a jumbled manner. Now, this is a buzzer round. Whoever presses the buzzer first will get the chance to answer. If it is incorrect, minus five for both cases. If you press the buzzer after the first clue, you'll get 10 points if it is correct. If you press the buzzer after the second clue, you'll get five points if it is correct. 
Spellers, your scores are very close. So anyone can make it through to the grand finale. Make proper use of this chance. All the very best. Before that, let's take a sip of Horlicks. All set? Good luck. Spellers, the first buzzword is a seven letter word and it means to make something clearer or easier to understand. And it starts with a C. That's Wasik. Is it clarify? C L A R Y R I F Y? Clarify? That is correct. Ten points. Very good. Second buzzword is a ten letter word and it means to expect something and it starts with an A. Yes, Ryan. The word is anticipate. A N T I C I P A T E. Anticipate. That is correct. Ten points for you, Ryan. The third buzz word is a ten letter word and it means to make an action or a process possible or easier. It starts with an F. Time off for the first clue. Sorry, can't take that. Get ready for the second clue and for five points. The second clue is on your screen. Yes, that's Ruga. Is it F A C I L I T A T E? Facilitate? That is correct. Five points for you, Ruka. <laughs> Moving on. The fourth buzzword is a seven letter word and it means willing to respect or accept behavior or opinions different from one's own. It starts with an L. Okay, what's it? Is it lenient? L E N I E N T, lenient? That is correct. Wow, 10 points for you. The next buzzword is an 11 letter word and it means the act of watching somebody or something carefully for a period of time. It starts with an O. Ryan. The word is observing. O B S E R V I N G. Observing. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. That means, Ryan, you cannot participate. Rest three of you get ready for the second clue and uh, you'll pay for five points. Ryan, you're losing five points. The second clue is on your screen. Koga, is it observation? O B S E R V A T I O N, observation. That is correct. Five points for you, Koga. Ryan, you said observing, that is a nine letter word, but we said the word has 11 letters. So, spellers, please listen to the clues properly. Going for the final one, all the best. Final buzzword is a 10 letter word, and it means having sound judgment or fair and sensible. It starts with an R. Ryan. The word is reasoning, R E S R E A S O N I N G, reasoning. I'm sorry that isn't correct. Ryan, once again, minus five. Rest three of you get ready for the second clue and play for five points. The second clue is on your screen. Okay, that's Proga. Is it reasonable? R E A S O N A B L E. Reasonable. That is correct. Five points for you. All right, that brings us to the end of our first playoff, and it's time to announce the final scores. Nabila at 40 points. Nabila, well tried. After that, we have Ryan at 70 points. They have shown a good effort. Next, we have Progga, always very lively, at 85 points. And now, the one speller who is going to join us for the grand finale. It's Wasik with 95 points. Congratulations, Wasik. And rest three, thank you very much. It's our pleasure to have you in our show. We had a wonderful time playing with you, asking you spellings. Thank you very much. Get set, ready, go, 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 go. Start this semi-final. We have been given to our four finalists. Orgho, Nayarin, Saif, and Hasin. Today's first playoff is that we are going to play our Ponchum finalist. And it is Wasek from Mary Curie School, Dhaka. Congratulations! We are going to play one of the actors who are going to join us in the grand finale. We are going to play the next 
সেকেন্ড প্লে অফ থেকে আপনারা অবশ্যই আমাদের সাথে আগামী পর্বে যোগ দিতে ভুলবেন না আর বিদায় নেওয়ার আগে আরও একবার মনে করে নেই আমাদের চ্যাম্পিয়ন্স প্যালারের জন্য কি কি অপেক্ষা করছে আমাদের চ্যাম্পিয়ন্স প্যালারের জন্য অপেক্ষা করছে এই গর্জেস ট্রফিটি তার পাশাপাশি ওয়াশিংটন ডিসিতে একজন অভিভাবক সহ ভ্রমণের সুযোগ ও পাঁচ লক্ষ টাকা মেট লাইফ আলিকো শিক্ষা বিমা আপনাদের অ্যান্ড্রয়েড ফোনে নিশ্চয়ই ডাউনলোড করে নিয়েছেন স্পেল চ্যাম্পস অ্যাপটি অ্যাপটি ব্যবহার করে অংশ নেন প্রতিযোগিতায় শুক্রবার থেকে মঙ্গলবার প্রতিদিন আর জিতে নিন আকর্ষণীয় ট্যাব হরলিক্সের সৌজন্যে বিজয়ের নাম দেখার জন্য লগ অন করুন ফেসবুক ডট কম স্ল্যাশ স্পেল বাংলাদেশে আজকের মতো এখানে বিদায় নিচ্ছি কিন্তু আপনারা চোখ রাখতে ভুলবেন না প্রতি সপ্তাহের বুধবার এবং বৃহস্পতিবার চ্যানেল আয়ের পর্দায় ঠিক সন্ধ্যা সাতটা পঞ্চাশ মিনিটে নেক্সট পর্ব কোনোভাবেই যেন মিস না হয় স্টে ওয়েল অ্যান্ড সেই টুগেদার গুড বাই স্পেলিং মিস্টেকস